Hello, Nelson Nerdes, my name is Phoenix, and today we're looking at Warbound. In the previous episode, we managed to complete two months since Nimor entered the land of Cardalia. We're currently level 9, we have leveled up quite nicely, our troops are quite powerful as well. If we look at our party, we have 7 Swedium Knights, quite a few men at arms, few footmen, and few militia as well. I think we should start thinking about our army compos composition in here. So far I think Cavalry is doing great, but they are really really expensive. These guys cost me 53 dinars each. That is a lot of money to pay for dudes. Pretty much twice the price of my men's at arms. But for now they're doing great, and they're doing a great job for it. We have quite a bit of money as well, so we're doing okay in here. And I think our job for now should be just to try to get more money going. Get some tasks from people around the from people around the cities and hopefully get some more renown. I really really need a village. I need to play in the place so we can start exploring our forces and being able to actually do something. The more we improve our initial village, the more money I will have and the money is power as we know it. Okay, here we are having a quick chat with the Grandmaster. You're looking for a job, yes. He wants to deliver seven alley to Suno. Well, it's not bad. Sono is only seven days, of, not, not far away at all. We're going to grab this task, because why not? Let's leave this place. We was going to go to Suno regardless, so let's go and do it. It's our only task for now. If we see anybody, we'll fight them. If we don't, we won't. There is a fighting going on in here. We're currently at the battle between the Kingdom of the North and our Kingdom in here. Mostly footmen and skirmishers. I don't think they will do that great. Vensus, veteran archers, trained warriors. I think we will. They will not do great in this battle, sadly. Yeah, I think the Nor our our troops will lose in here. The Swedians that I decided to stay with, stay with, but that's fine. Let's pop into Suno. And deal with it. Okay, we're going to go to the tavern. See what we can find out in here. Lazalit, we'll talk to you in a minute, mate. Well, for now, deliver our ally in here. Got some experience from that. Not sure we got renown, but we improve our relationships with both of the cities, which is great. I'd like to bind everyone who comes in here. A jar of your best wine. How much is that? A thousand dinars. <laughs> Maybe not. But that's fine. Let's talk to you, my friend Lazalit. Let's see what you have on offer. Welcome back, my friend. You are the one that got knocked out, so you join my party back. Great to see you back. We're going to go on the streets and we're going to talk to a local master as well. Okay, what do you have to offer me as a job? The herd must be in Ahmarid within 60, uh, 30 days. Sooner the better, much better. It must be absolutely no later than 30 days. He will pay 615 dinars for that. Ahmarat. Ahmarat is miles away. I mean it like miles, miles away. I will have to say no to that then. Sorry about that. But no. Let's look at the party. The Zalit. You don't have any skills as Alit either. But they only have mere low wages there, we'll take that. Do you have any skills that are worth of anything? Not really. No skills whatsoever at all. That's fine. Well, we'll go to Praven, we'll see there's a job waiting for us in Praven. And let's see what we can find out from there. Getting few jobs is always good. We'll see our renown as well if we, it improved from completing this task or not. Good job we have a horse through the city because it's quite big. Well, easiest way to stop the horse is to run it through the wall. Yeah, perfect. You see? The best way. Much faster than pressing the S, S bottom in here. 
The Guildmaster. Do you have a job for me? Caravan of goods to Barin. However, I'll disband this, that's fine. And you will pay quite well. That's fine, I will take this job for you. Let's leave. Reports, do I have any more renown? I don't, sadly, for this mission, but that's fine. Let's talk to Caravan. Okay, I will take you to the safe route. That's fine. Let's see the notes. Bree. Of course it would be. Miles, miles away. Well, that's fine. We should be able to complete this mission reasonably okay. Oh my goodness me. The furthest of the furthest cities. Well, that's fine, I guess. We'll try to ride there reasonably quick. Spidina and Rodax has expired the peace. That's fine. I don't think they will be fighting each other because... We're currently at war with other cities. Don't want to lose my caravan though. And we managed to meet a few forest bandits. I think it's always worth taking them down. Especially now with my huge cavalry, I really need to be making money. The forest bandits are not bad for making money. Also I need to level up my guy. So the more of them I can kill myself, the better. Like I will park here. And start shooting perfect damage. Not bad. I should do decent shots there. Let's shoot the troops. Awesome. Attacking my knight. We can't allow this to happen. Okay, let's go into battle closer. Where are they? Where are they? Move the way. Perfect. Okay, we've done actually decently. We kill somebody, they kill somebody. We're going to say no to that. What have we achieved here? Sweden men's at arms, that's fine. Casualties. Forest bandits. I wish I knew who I killed. Good armor. Good arrows. Overall, everything is good in here. Not bad, actually. Quite a bit of experience. Quite a bit of items from the guys. Well, since we are here, may as well pop to the city on the way. And let's sell stuff. Uh, maybe not dried meat, because I need it. But everything else will definitely be selling. Any money we can make from them is good money. Actually not bad, nearly 400 we made from them. Which I'm quite impressed with. Do I have anything cheap in here? Not sure, but there is a lot of pottery going in here. Let's buy this pottery. For 118, 120 it sells, that's fine, we'll buy a few of those. And we'll see how it goes for us in next city on the way. Halmar is the next city on the way. That's fine, we'll get there and we'll see how it goes with the pottery business in here. Okay, we have arrived at Halmar. Let's see how our pottery business worked out, tragically. Tragically, the pottery here is cheap. Well, we're going to buy all of them then. I'm going to sell them somewhere else. They only cost 50 from here. Maybe we can sell them quite nicely in the nearest city, which is Durkabwa, whatever it's called. That's fine. Let's go there. And well, let's see how it goes for my people here. There is a few desert bandits approaching our caravan. For now, I'm just trying to scare them away. We'll see how the things sell in Drukaboa. Pottery is still ridiculously cheap in this land. Why well, is that cheap? We'll keep buying it from here, I guess. Because what else can we do? Let's just buy as much as we can and sell it somewhere else. Everything else is reasonably expensive, so for now we'll keep it as it is. That's fine. Barry is nearly here. That's fine.
bandits are coming. Come on, caravan, don't run away. We need you to follow me. Here to protect you, so don't panic. And we are here. That's fine. Our caravan is pretty much safe. Let's talk to my dudes in here. And let's see, we got some money, we got some renown from that as well. People leveled up in here, so I'm quite happy with them levels. Let's trade in the city as well, marketplace, goods. Pottery is still cheap, we're going to buy it. We're going to buy some date fruits as well. And a cheap salt, that's fine. Do I have enough money? I don't, sadly. So we're going to just buy the pottery from here. Okay, we're going to have a massive pottery business going. And we're going to hit Dachrim. We have arrived quite successfully at Dachrim. Let's go to marketplace and see how the pottery is selling in here. Actually quite okay, so we're going to sell a few of those until the price hits 90. Have enough food in here, our chicken is rotten, we're going to sell that. We don't want people to eat rotten food. Going to buy some grain for them because it's cheap. And a little bit of bread as well. Okay. Surely we made some money back from that, that's fine. Going to hit Ux Hall and sell some more of our stuff. And then we we'll have to deal with starting a business, I think. And also getting some jobs going, so let's do that as well. Pottery is selling quite well. We did actually sell it quite okay. Got quite a bit of money from that. Good business, good job. I think what we're going to be doing. We're going to start making more money because it's not looking great. Going to hit Kurao, get a steel. Get the steel business going from there. And then keep moving our people. We really need to have two businesses going. And maybe we can pick up a job as well. So let's go. Marketplace first. Load your goods. You have a lot of iron that I would like to buy. Have a cheap tools as well, I will buy them as well. That will sell quite nicely in here. Keep grain and bread in here. And awesome. Your food is expensive, so we're going to be buying from you. Okay, with that, going to walk the streets of Kurla and we'll talk to the guildmaster and we'll see if there's a job going for anyone interested. Any renown is good renown, so that's all I need. And the guildmaster is in here. Do you have any job for me? The kettle herd. No, we're not doing kettle herd. Caravans are bad as it is. So Kettle Heart will have to leave us. River check, we'll go there. Definitely for sure. You will see any forest bandits will grab them as well on the way. Moment I don't see any. Oh, there is few. Tundra bandits, 10, the weak. Sea Raiders 20. I'm actually quite slow because of the equipment they carry. Let's sell it first then. Okay, let's go to marketplace, let's sell all the goods. Tools are cheap in here, but still expensive, so we're going to sell all the steel we have. Good money from that. Going to buy silk. And call that a day. That's quite a bit of money. Going to go to Vertrek, and you will grab any people on the way. Any sea raiders on the way will eat them alive. Drink from their schools for a change. Sea Raiders 11. Okay, let's grab them. Their speed is 5.7, our is 6.1. We'll grab them. And we'll charge them. Pretty much. My cavalry should do a decent job at it. Maybe I can get some kills. That would be great. If not, maybe I can at least get some equipment. We have enhanced looting on one of our companions. So hopefully we'll get some more loot. Part of that we're doing great. 
sadly we're charging up the hill, which is not ideal. Come on, everybody. Come on. Yes, I killed somebody. I'm actually getting good at this game. Probably the fact that I have more life now allows me to survive better. Perfect, okay, we won the battle. Won the battle, we'll grab the loot because, hey, loot is always welcomed. One person wounded Nizar. Nizar sucks as always. We can't capture people, sadly. Nordic, Nordic sword, 28. Good weapon reach, better than Falchion, definitely. Should probably swap it. And not bad helmet. Let's have it. Okay, I advanced to level 10, so let's level up in here. I think we should be leveling up our charisma now. At least to level 12, let's grab it. Should be investing in persuasion, just to be able to persuade people to do whatever we need them to do. And let's invest in the power arms again. Awesome. Virtuk. If we can go there, we'll sell everything, buy salt, and sell it again. Cheapest salt in town. Buy that. Tools didn't sell very well in here. It's actually surprising. Well, that's okay. Smoked fish will buy a few of those, because they're cheap. And a cabbage, I guess. Okay, I'm okay with that. We actually made the good money here. Going to hit Kurao, and we'll see if the salt sells there okay. Let's check it out. Marketplace and the goods. And the soul sells very nicely. So we made really nice profit here. Really excellent profit. I'm really impressed with that. They have steel again. We're going to buy the iron then. And that's not bad. That's really not bad. Good money, 800. Of income. We're going to do, we have to hit our city of Uxhal, deliver our items so we can have more money and then sell the rest of the iron. I think like we're doing okay. Our trading little caravan in here actually worked quite okay. So let's go to Ironworks, we're going to drop some iron with you. Show me what you have. You have one iron on you. We're going to leave you another one. We're going to sell those and hopefully make enough money to start another business. Let's leave. Suno, how are you for tools and iron? I swear that you're going to be quite okay. Let's check you out. Tools are cheap everywhere. Well, we're going to sell them because I don't want to carry them everywhere. I'll keep them with me to just go to Praven first. Alcohol is quite expensive in here. Okay, thousand dinars for that. Leaves me on nearly three thousand dinars. Let's go to Praven quick. And let's go to Marketplace and see what they have. Tools are badly, but we're going to grab Alley. Because that will sell okay. I will have to call that a day with the alley. That's fine. Well, let's run to Suno again and we'll see what we can do in Suno with alley. I think alley will sell there quite well. So, we made nice profit of 545 for that. 
will be able to start a new business in here as well. And so what we're going to do, we're going to walk the streets in here and start the iron business. Another iron works. Two of those I can support them with the iron I'm buying from uh, the other place, from the, from the other cities, and that should work quite okay in initially at least. Bring us 14,000 dinners. Let's talk to Guildmaster. And I would like to Enterprise. The Enterprise I would like. The guild would like to nominate it better, really? Okay, well if that's the case, let's get a job. Escort the caravan. 362 dinars to bury... Oh no. Well, okay, I will escort him again, I guess. That's fine. That's fine, we'll have to escort this caravan, guys. That's our job for, for probably next time. For now, I'm going to finish the episode in here, guys. Thank you everybody for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Hopefully you will enjoy the new episode.